We are here to bring you the most important and relevant news in the woodworking world. That's right. First up, Bourbon Mouth. Jason Hibbs, he, uh, he humbled himself and he went out there and he made a epoxy river table. And I'm proud of him for being humble and stepping a little bit outside of woodworking. I think he did a good job. You clearly didn't watch the video. No, I didn't make it through the whole thing. Let's just say that uh, God intervened. Moses intervened and saved his soul. It might not be what you thought it was, and you might not be speaking so highly of him humbling himself. But you know what I will say about Bourbon Moth is he's still making fun of epoxy river tables. And I had to stop because I got shut down. I made fun of epoxy river tables too much and they like canceled me and I had to. That's right. Well, I did a little more research on the man, Jason Hibbs, mm -hmm. and I found some, some footage from a while back. It's a, oh, is that Miley Cyrus? That is a Miley Cyrus song. And that's Jason Hibbs without a beard in black and white on the staircase, lip syncing it. It's pretty grand. He's a talented man. Yeah, I'll guy. put a link in the description, but I'd, I'd like to know how he went from this to this. Woodworking makes you a man. Yeah. Jason Hibbs is perfect. In other news. Maybe if you just put on a flannel and grow a beard, you just become a man. What makes a man? That's a good question. In other news. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that brings us to just the tip of the month. Rob Cosman with the Mox and Vice. That we're doing this month. Yeah, it's a new video. I thought he was dead. Rob Cosman? <laughs> he's not that old. Uh, well, all of his videos look like they're from the 1960s. Like, yeah, he's got a vintage feel for sure. He's definitely, he must yeah. have a vintage LUT on his. Well, I apologize, Rob Cosman. The moxen vise attaches to your stable table saw, so it's not all shaking around. Great for beginner shop where we don't normally have a stable bench. That makes sense. That Check makes out that video. Yeah, it's yeah, a good video. Like, I remember uh, in my little backyard shop, I always had the rickety MFT table and I had to clamp it to the sides of some walls to make it so it didn't rack. Exactly. And now I'm thinking about that. That would have been fantastic to have a moxen vise attached to the side of a table saw. Good job, Rob. All right. Good job, Rob. Good job, old man. Good job, Grandpa. Good job, Rob. Brings the great tip from the grave. Great tip from the grave? Rob Cosman. <laughs> In other news, that brings us to Mark Spagnolo Wood Whistler. Wood Whisperer. That's what I said. Okay, so so here's here's what's great about Mark. And also kind of sad. He lost his sponsorship with Powermatic. And that's kind of crazy because we all know Mark and Powermatic, they go together like, like I don't know, OJ Simpson and his Bronco. Like uh, apples and oranges. Nah, not like uh, Michael Jackson and his white glove. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't, don't bring Michael into this. All right, how about Elvis Presley and drugs? Yeah. All I'm trying to say is you can't imagine one without the other. Mark and Powermatic have always been known as like kind of a package deal and it's cool to see him break apart from that because now we get to get his opinion on other machines and tools that we might not have got to see his opinion on. So I'm excited for it, but I'm sorry for your loss. Speaking of tools, we got the deal of the month. Bridge City has their HP9, it's their block plane. It's 50% off right now. So it's like 389. Don't we have one? 389, we do have one. Where's it at? It's over there. I'm gonna grab it. Yeah. Grab Dude, it. Why how much was it? $389 right now. Here we are, folks. Call in right now and you can get yours for the same price that they're doing that on the website. The uh, special guest today is our air compressor. Surprise visit. It comes by a couple times a day. It's a giant air compressor and they had to pump in some new electrical wiring for it. There's some wiring to help the compressor to take the pressure good, Todd. and release the pressure into the tool so it can do the job. Christopher Walken. Yeah, it's great Christopher Walken. Oh, uh, great Christopher Walken. <laughs> Shut up. You know what? What? That that deal kind of came out of nowhere. It did kind of come out of nowhere. Another thing that came out of nowhere was Lincoln Street. That channel, 
I remember the first few videos I, I saw, I was like, damn, are we watching our own videos here? This is good. Well, I think he was really inspired by us. Originally, he had written me saying, hey, thank you for creating a channel that's very different, it inspired me to create a YouTube channel. And he just blew right past us. Yeah, totally. Impressive. The guy's, uh, he's been able to throw us some good tips and pointers along the way too. Yeah, I think he's really got this YouTube thing figured out. I've asked him for actually help in understanding analytics and stuff. He's got a cool new video coming out. It might be out by now. By the time we release this video, it might have came out the weekend before. But he de he does have one coming out or did release one where he's covering how he went from a zero to 100,000 subscribers so quickly. And he's even breaking down how much money that he made in that. And uh, it's definitely more money than we made. Yeah, you should watch this video. I'm going to watch this video and hopefully pick up some tips. Good job, John. And I appreciate you. Now let's move on to Jedi's pick of the month. All right, when I'm try? digging through my YouTubes, when I'm doing the, the wood tubing, when I'm YouTube tubing, when I'm doobie tubing, when I'm smoking a doob and hitting the tube. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> so when I'm smoking a doob and hitting the tube, I like to sometimes scrape the bottom. I don't always click on the one that has 10 million views. I like to sometimes click the one that, the dark horse. Yeah. Right? My dark horse this week is Generation Woodworks. But before I introduce this, let me ask you a question, Will. Sure. What kind of tree would you be if you could be any tree? I, I actually get asked that a lot. I bet. You know, and, and I think the answer is pretty clear. I'd be, uh, I'd be a dollar tree. Why would you be the dollar tree? You go to the dollar tree and you get a lot for a little. And I like to think that I give a lot for just a little. That's what this video did. It, before we talk about this video, let's talk about how I can give a lot for a little. You can buy some merch from us. <laughs> <laughs> we got some great shirts. Look at that. Craftsman never cries. Craftsman never lies. And craftsman never dies. All right. So who, okay, back to your discovery of the week. Generations discovery. Woodworks. Yeah. It is called Woodworking, Woodwork Shopping at the Dollar Store. The video is amazing. I'll put a link to that video. You'll, you'll get as much value out of that video as you will at the Dollar Store. People who are small. He likes to spend money. It, it. I'm really good at it, spending money, but again, let's move on to... What's your discovery of the week? My discovery... Money bags? Week. Money bags. My What's discovery. your discovery of the week? So my discovery of the week... <laughs> Mr. McDuck? There is a gentleman out here <laughs> creating waves, okay? So everybody has a very short attention span these days, and uh, I enjoy a person who is not afraid to tackle a hard project that they know may take them a month or longer. Not a lot of people can get past doing a project that takes blah, longer than a blah, cutting board. Blah. Exactly Dude, my point. The heck <laughs> so this guy, Michael Alm, Nightmare Alm. on Elm Street. Alm. Alm, I think like it's almond. short for Almond, like the I Almond see. Brothers. I see. Well, I enjoy your milk it's and I also milk. enjoyed your video it's because it showed that you were not afraid to tackle a difficult project. He also released plans. It's a coffee table that moves into a dining height table. Really rad, that I'm impressed, rad. and he did a good job. He released plans. No one's gonna buy those plans though, I'm sorry, because it is gonna take anybody else a month to build, and I'm probably the only person who would buy your plans. I'll buy your plans. He's buying your I plans. Because I support you. Good job, keep it up, and if you, just some advice, if you release plans on a cutting board, you're probably gonna get rid of a lot more of those plans than you are a month long project. Speaking of plans, we have some other plans today. Let's uh, close this out. Let's close it out. Okay, we gotta get back to work. So from everybody here at WDC <laughs> TV, we'd like to thank you for watching this video. We hope it was helpful to you. And remember, a craftsman never lies. I mean, dies. A craftsman never dies. Yeah. Craftsman never dies. I can see.